the next award is for best theatre choreographer, named <laughs> named in honour of the great Dame Gillian Lynn. I am so proud to say that Jilly was a beloved friend of mine and was hugely supportive to me, amazingly, throughout my career. You know, she once sent me a letter, which I have kept to this day, in which she told me, you keep those long, magnificent gams of yours kicking, my girl. <laughs> Advice I've never forgotten. Her legacy lives on through the Lynn and Land Foundation, which I am delighted to be a patron of. And it's wonderful that Jilly's beautiful husband, Peter Land, is here tonight. Where are you? Hello, my friend. Look at us! <laughs> to present the award, fellow patron, legendary choreographer, and artistic director of New Adventures, Sir Matthew Bourne. <laughs> Good evening, everyone. Um, I'm sure all choreographers here, all the dancers, in fact, everyone, were absolutely thrilled to hear that this award was to be renamed in honor of one of Britain's greatest dance, um, chore dancers, yes, dancer, choreographers, and directors, uh, the much loved and much missed Dame Gillian Lynn. Um, you stole my speech, Ham. <laughs> The thing people don't know about uh, Jilly so much, we all know about her legendary and long career, uh, but she was also a great supporter, a mentor, friend to young and emerging choreographers. And so it seems absolutely right that her name is on this award forevermore. So I'm very proud to be here tonight to present the first Gillian Lynn Best Theatre Choreographer Award, and the nominees are... Gillian Lynn Award for Best Theatre Choreographer. Matt Cole for Disney's Newsies at the Cubital Wembley Park Theatre. Lynn Page for Standing at the Sky's Edge at the National Theatre Olivier. Kate Prince for Sylvia at the Old Bay. Basil Twist for Puppetry Direction for My Neighbour Totoro at the Barbican Theatre. A very fine group of nominees, but the Olivier goes to Matt Cole. Um, I never in a million, million years ever thought that I would stand up here and I never in a million years thought that I would ever hold one of these. Um, there are a million people to thank uh, to make this happen, to get somebody like me to hear. The first people I have to thank are my parents. Thank you for letting me dance. That was a really big thing. Thank you for letting me dance. Um, it, to create a show like this doesn't just happen, it takes lots of people. Um, I have to thank our producers, Tristan Baker and the team at Runaway Entertainment and all of our co-producers. Thank you for believing in me, thank you for letting me have a go. <laughs> um, I have to thank our incredible creative team who uh, came on this journey with me. It was, it was an incredible journey, and you were with me by my side every step of the way. Um, I have to thank Nigel Lilly for his <laughs> incredible dance um, arrangements. Without the music, the dance is meaningless, and Nigel really went above and beyond to create such spectacular music. Um, I have to thank my associate choreographer, Jay McMurtry. <laughs> Thank you. 
Jane always has been by my side for 20 years. We were at college together in the same year. Um, and she always goes above and beyond, and without her, this show wouldn't have happened. And finally, I have to thank the incredible cast, who... Every, every single night, they go out onto that stage and they dance with such passion and skill and dedication and joy, and I am in absolute awe of you. I think that you prove that the standard of dance in British musical theatre is the highest that it has ever been. I am, I am incredibly proud of you, and I, I know that without you, this show is nothing. You are everything, and I'm so proud of you. This is for you. Thank you so much.